click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, welcome to the subject of Machine Design 1. We are right now in the process of learning the design problems or design numerical of thick cylinders. So far we have solved two different numerical and let us proceed for the third one. It is there in front of you. It says that a pipe width. Now when they say pipe, it has to be some internal and external diameter. So it falls under the category of cylinders. So pipe width internal diameter of 400 mm is to carry a fluid pressure of 12 meter megapascal. So that is 12 Newton per mm square. We have been given the internal diameter which is very crucial. We have been given the internal pressure that is going to act inside the pipe. If the maximum stress in the material of the pipe is restricted to 110 mega Pascal, that is 110 Newton per mm square, calculate the minimum thickness of the pipe required. So guys, here in this case, they have not specified the external diameter. Instead, they have asked for the minimum thickness that is safe. So this is a kind of problem where we need to we need to design the dimensions of the pipe, the missing dimension, which is the thickness in our case. Let's quickly draw the diagram and then write down the given data. So pipe looks like somewhat like this. Where we have been specified the internal radius small r of course 400 mm we have to design this factor which is its thickness we have been given the internal pressure let us say pr so pr given is 12 mega pascal that makes it 12 Newton per mm square. We also have been given the maximum stress that the, that the material can carry. So it's a kind of material property. So the stress that the material can carry. Now when they say it's the maximum stress, they generally are talking about the radial stress. Now guys, you need to understand this thing. We know that radial stress is always smaller than the circumferential stress. So if in the design, in the design uh, data, if they specify some allowable value of stress, if we consider that value, for the circumferential stress, we are actually under designing the problem. Are you getting what I am saying? I will repeat this. If the allowable stress, I consider the circumferential stress, I am under designing the given problem. So, I will design it for the radial stress, which is the minimum of all. So, if I designing it for radial stress, the given problem can sustain more the value. Fine. And that's why I'm considering sigma radial. So sigma radial given is 140 Newton per mm square. Sorry, 110 Newton per mm square. With this data, let us proceed. Again, we are going to use Lemmy's equation. And we know that the radial pressure or the pressure inside the cylinder is given by b divided by small r square minus a and we also know that the radial stress is given by b upon x square plus a circumferential stress I'm really sorry also the radial stress is given by b upon x square 
minus a. So these are prominently the Lemmy's equations we have. And therefore, the substitutive value 12 is equal to b divided by 200 square minus a. That's my expression number 1. What else I can define is, we know that the circumferential stress which is 110 in our case is equal to b upon 200 square which is the internal radius plus a. Now in these two equations when I solve them I will get the value of a and b. So upon solving them I will get value of a as 49 and value of b as 2440000. After substituting these values in Lemmy's equation, I'll get the equation in this form. Sigma at the outer edge is equal to b upon r square outer edge is equal to a, which has to be equal to 0 because the radius ends right radius ends at the outer surface so since the radius is ending the stress at the outer surface also is becoming zero the radial stress or at the outer surface becomes zero and that's why i'm equating it to zero and therefore the value of b which is divided by r square so r value we have at the outer surface will be the outermost radius minus the value of a which is 49 has to be equal to 0. If I shuffle this I have the only one unknown parameter and therefore the value of r I can find out is 223.15 mm. Somehow this is the value of radius we have obtained right the outer radius but we need to find out the thickness of it and hence in the next step we are going to find out the thickness and therefore thickness of the cylinder is given by small t is equal to the outer radius minus the inner radius outer radius we know Right now we have found out is 223.15 minus 200 which is the inner radius and hence the thickness comes out to be 23.15 millimeter. So this is the expected answer from the given problem. Let me quickly rewind. We had started with the given value of radius and the internal pressure and the permissible value of the stress. We substituted them in Lemmy's equation. We solved Lemmy's equation simultaneously for the given two values and we found out the values of the factors a and b. We resubstituted them in Lemmy's equation and then we substituted the value of the given radius. At the end we found out the value of outer radius. Now we know that thickness is basically the outer radius minus inner radius and hence we found out the thickness for the cylinder. So this is the permissible value of thickness. Now we have already learned the topic of preferred series. We know that to prepare this particular thickness it's quite difficult thing. So we can go for a better available value of thickness the closer one to this. So we'll go for the next value of the thickness which is possible. right? Now this, since the thickness is directly proportional to the outer and inner radii, we have to go for the higher value of thickness and hence the T is equal to 24 mm will be the preferred value of thickness and we will use this value for the manufacturing process. Thank you for watching this video. In upcoming video, we will go for one more numerical which is based on the proper design of a thick cylinder which may use some 
standard codes given laid by, down by standard agencies. If you like this video, please subscribe to Ikeda.